Our Earth is surrounded by a protective atmosphere. It helps keep the Earth warm and protects us from comets and meteors. This atmosphere can be divided into four layers separated by changes in air temperature. These layers are the trophosphere, the stratosphere, the mesosphere, and the thermosphere. Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science and the layers of the atmosphere. The first layer is called the trophosphere and is composed of 78% nitrogen, 21% oxygen, and 1% other gases including argon. It is a layer where we live and is a layer where weather occurs. The atmosphere in the trophosphere actually presses down with a great deal of pressure each day, but many times we don't even notice this. In fact, this Coke can is crushed by our atmosphere. As you go upward in the trophosphere, the temperature drops. This is called the lapse rate, and the temperature drops around 3 degrees Fahrenheit for each 1,000 feet in elevation. For example, in my state, the city of Augusta has an elevation of 136 feet and has an average high temperature of the year for, of 77 degrees. Blairsville is over 3,000 feet and has an average high temperature of only 68 degrees. The trophosphere extends from the ground to about 10 kilometers. This is equal to about 25 laps around a track. At the very top of the trophosphere, the temperature may drop to negative 52 degrees Celsius. This begins our next layer called the stratosphere. The ozone layer is found in the stratosphere. The ozone layer protects us from ultraviolet light rays given off by the sun. As you get higher in the stratosphere, however, the temperature actually gets warmer. This is because the ozone layer absorbs ultraviolet rays and warms up the stratosphere. 50 kilometers above the Earth, we move to the next layer called the mesosphere. The mesosphere gets colder as you go upward. In fact, it is the coldest layer and can have temperatures as low as negative 90 degrees Celsius. The mesosphere protects the Earth from space junk like meteors because of the ice crystals burn up the space junk as it moves through and it extends up to 80 kilometers high. And finally, you have the thermosphere, which is very hot. In fact, it is the hottest layer and you can have temperatures between 500 and 1500 degrees. Two additional layers of our atmosphere is the ionosphere, which is full of electrically charged atoms and is home of the northern and southern lights. It also reflects back radio waves. And the exosphere, which is the outermost layer of our atmosphere and stretches almost 10,000 kilometers into space. It is composed of helium and several heavy molecules like carbon dioxide, but they are spread very far apart. It is home, also home to satellites, so there we go, the layers of the atmosphere. If you'd like to know more about the layers of the atmosphere, this playlist will help. And as always, thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.